there goes the first fist of the match. Channel 4, which is Radicano's beloved F1 network, where she watches all the, all the cars whiz by. <laughs> Such a good point from Radicano in this point kept defending off the backhand until she got that shot where she could step in just a little bit more. Can she take it any earlier? <laughs> it's very, it would be very hard to. <laughs> and that's at her forehead. That is. Thank you. shots into that corner and this one no different good depth and pace yes. recognize Steve Nash the NBA fame fellow Canadian Took a while. Oh, talk about not panicking there. I mean, just cool and calm yes. as you please coming up with that. Tried to take it early there, Fernandez. A break right back. drop shot, reading the court, seeing the position of Raducanu and playing the perfect shot. Remarkable two weeks of 2021 U.S. Open.
ability of Fernandez taking that ball early is really disrupting the Raducanu timing. She's just not expecting that ball to come back with interest. This is definitely a different rhythm. For Raducanu in terms of you know, what she's got to produce. Leaning into that last forehand. They've both made big recoveries from Wimbledon. Just loving the battle here. I can only imagine what uh, she is saying it's right now. Non, I, <laughs> as someone who's watched a lot of tennis matches alongside Billy, it's nonstop commentary. <laughs> this forehand in good position and that requires very good timing. these two about are about only wanting to stay in the blue part of this court. Kanu still Fitima. has some unknowns. So good. sentence <laughs> with some numbers that young kid that 18 year old qualifier ranked 150 in the world in her second ever major is one set away from her first grand slam title one of the players she really enjoyed watching play as a kid was lee now hmm. two-time grand slam champion can, can't you see that in her game absolutely yeah 
Luke, can you see Lee Na in Raducanu's game? I see a lot of composure between those two. Yeah. First game, Just, second no set. matter what's going on, the ability to block out the noise and stay with the program. She's in trouble here. Just have a quick look at Pam Shriver interviewing Tim Henman. There's Penny. What company to be in? Yeah. That's, a beautiful, that's beautiful. Yes. has had fewer break opportunities, but this could be another big one. Connected well with that return. It made it even tougher. Yeah, it took a lot of pace off that ball. So there was no juice to get to Fernandez. Yeah. Goes after that serve again. Serves just come back in a hurry. Yeah, set and her up. Huh? They are shown that as well. Age is a high price to pay for maturity. <laughs> And she's two you games guys, away yes. this qualifier from winning this thing. <laughs> she just, she guessed right, didn't she? Yeah, oh, a little four love from Rajan Rondo. Yeah. But that, this is, I mean, this is a game changer. Three of them were at Wimbledon. <laughs> <laughs> What's Four? your point, Luke? What's your point, <laughs> though? One not Fernandez showing her speed and court sense.
such a good pattern, Larry, yep. to be able to hit it. Much more committed to that forehand. Better direction on that shot, and it still got a little tricky. How's that for an ending? She went 10 rounds without dropping a set. She came in here ranked 150 in the world and she leaves the US Open champion. Say hello to Emma Raducanu.